Hi, it's Denise. Just wanted to do a quick video on how to clean the Instant Pot. Um, a lot of people don't realize how much stuff comes apart on these. So this is the Instant Pot lid. Uh, see, there we go. And this comes off. It's supposed to come off for cleaning. And uh, that's the venting and sealing part. And then if we turn it upside down, this seal comes out and it's best to take this out. This whole thing can go in the dishwasher but sometimes you just want to give it a quick wash because you didn't really do much with it. So I'll just put all the pieces over there for now. And then this comes apart as well. I don't know, can you see that? So this goes in here and this goes on top of it. But that also allows you to clean that because sometimes when we're making something really wet like soups or chilies or something like that it really gets messy and then this part here just pops off it's really sometimes you really have to pull this one is coming off really easy but this part here stays in this part doesn't come out okay so that's taking all of that apart so that it can be washed the next thing i do besides wash all those pieces and then put it all back together is you gotta make sure everything on here is clean. So we'll just give our, our outside of it a nice wipe down. You can use some Barkeepers uh, lotion. I can't think of what that stuff's called, Barkeepers. I think it's just called Barkeep. Barkeep, yeah. Okay, so you just give it a good wipe down everywhere. Now, you got these grooves up here. They're a little bit more challenging for just using a cloth on. So you can see I was making greasy hamburger, so it's all greasy in there. So I like to use uh, a little brush. Oh, I lost my, <laughs> I lost my sink uh, drain stopper. So we're just gonna put a little soap on here. Normally I would just fill the sink with some soapy water. Oh, well, there it is, thanks. And then just get in all the, you can't put this whole thing in the sink because it's an electrical appliance. So just get in here really good in all the grooves. And then we'll use our cloth to rinse it off. Ooh, we're getting a little water inside. It's okay to get a little, just don't soak it. It is an electrical appliance. It would, if you get water in there, you're gonna have to let it dry really good because otherwise it may not work again. I used a little too much soap. Normally this is a little faster. And like I said, the lid and the liner can go in the dishwasher. The lid goes on the top rack, same with the seal, and the liner goes on the bottom rack. So that is how you keep your Instant Pot nice and clean. Thanks for watching.